defeating this I don't, race. I, I don't, I don't. At the end of the day, the fair thing to do is to refund all tickets, uh, but you kind of, uh, now you're in a situation of, uh, I mean, listen, at the end of the day, the fair thing to do is to refund all tickets, uh, but you kind of uh, up against the wall if you bet the exotics, because then you are stuck with the post-time favorite, not who you chose. She didn't win anyway. I mean, this um, is remarkable, by you guys. Hello, money. Yeah, it is you got, remarkable. You've you got, got, you got a steward that is watching this I don't, race. I, I, don't, I don't get and it. And for the inquiry sign not to be up immediately is, is mind-boggling. I've seen, and here's the thing is, I, I've seen a horse here at Saratoga before actually break through the gate, actually stopped. The rider stopped on the horse like you're talking about, Gary. The horse came around and finished second. They called the horse a non-starter. I don't know why there's not an inquiry up. I don't know what's going on here at all um you're right uh well, let's look guys we know that uh, the stewards obviously are looking at it the sign has not put up been put up yet but that's what's happening right now it so takes, it takes a, uh, somebody to push a button that says inquiry let the let the public know agreed in the meantime we will wait and see what happens with the fate here of the nine in terms of being a starter or declared a non-starter we'll have that for you travers essential quality the Bud Catini on the center to win it. Back on Saratoga Live here on Fox Sports 2 and Regional Networks out in Southern California. This late pick five begins with a big price here, 13 to 1 by Hubby Hello Money. Still no inquiry sign flashing on the board, which is surprising here, but it is still unofficial. So you know it's still being looked at, but strange to see that that sign is not flashing. Let's go back again, and for those just tuning in, show you again what happened with the nine, your four to five favorite, and now we're being told, wow, this went official. Wow. No change. There was not even an inquiry. Um, I, I, uh, all I can say is I'm a bit dumbfounded, and I don't have any um, reason that I can say why there was not an inquiry. It's in the rules of racing um, in every jurisdiction. The problem, so. Here's the thing is we have, a, Gary, and you'll, you'll say this too, Tom, as well. We have so many issues in this sport with jurisdictions and different violations that are some are violations in this jurisdiction, some aren't in this. This right here, in almost in every, if I'm not mistaken, in every jurisdiction, if the horse breaks through the gate before he's declared a non-starter. Am I right here, Tom? Yeah, I'm, I'm stunned. I, I, I can't defend this. I don't know how to defend this, except to say that people lose their job over this kind of thing. Well, There's a lot of money bet on a four to five favorite in here that should have been declared a non-starter. You've got to respect the betting public. They make they make the game go. The Tom, public and the betting makes the game go. For them not to, to respect that and do the right job by the public is astonishing. Uh, Tom, uh, 